Abundant Water's Guide to Making Clay Water Filters, Part 2, Mixing the Clay. Mixing the clay is one of the most important steps in the filter making process. Sifting your dry materials ensures equal particle size and prevents clumping. First, sift your burnout material. We're using old coffee grounds from Joma, our local coffee shop. You'll also want to sift your dried clay. The finished filter material is exactly half burnout material and half dried clay. After sifting, we have to mix thoroughly for even distribution of our material. Take your time to mix the clay and burnout material completely so that the whole product becomes the same color. If there are clumps of one material, your filter will not work correctly. Form a well in the middle of the dry mixture and begin adding water. Slowly pour in the water and begin mixing our wet clay. Keep slowly adding more water and mixing with the hands to form wet clay. Knead the dry clay into a wet compound. When some of the clay has achieved the right consistency, set it aside and continue adding water until all of the dry material becomes moldable wet clay. Once the dry material has become wet clay, it's time to begin kneading the clay. We use our feet to compress the clay and work it into the perfect consistency for making clay water filters. We use the tarp to help roll the clay back into shape. Then we continue walking the clay. It should take about 15 to 20 minutes of kneading and rolling to get a proper mixture. Once the clay is ready to be worked with, we can move on to the next step, molding the filter.